Hi, this is Dr. Gary. Welcome to the Daily Tune-Up today. Today we're going to talk about rationalization and what that really is and how it applies to us. I've got a little bit different twist on it that I think you might find kind of interesting. First of all, let's just talk about you're doing something and someone what appears to be criticizing you or telling you you could do something better. What's really going on there is they're giving you feedback. It's not really criticism, it's just their view of what could be different. And one of the things people miss is when people tell you that, that means they're actually interested in what you're doing. And so many people take that as criticism or something negative if they don't absolutely agree with everything you're doing. We call that rationalization when we decide to blow that off and just continue to do what we're doing and say that other person doesn't know what they're talking about. Well, of course they do. They're viewing you doing something. They have an opinion. And a lot of times, two heads are better than one when it comes down to creating ideas. So let's take a look at rationalization for a moment. And what does that really mean? It's rooted in the word rational, you know, making sense out of something. But the last part of it is lies rationalize. What that means is you're lying to yourself. And that's usually most of the lying that's going on in the world anyway, is us lying to ourselves. When we rationalize something that someone else calls out to us, we could be doing wrong or we could improve upon, whether it's our performance in our job, whether it's our performance in just our relationship, or just our performance in the way we spell, which I could use a lot of help with. Rationalizing means you're not growing. Like these tune-ups, if you've started with me over a year and a half ago with these tune-ups, you've seen them do a lot of changing. The reason they've changed is because I've had a lot of people criticizing, commenting, some love it, some don't, thinking this would be a nice addition, how come you don't do this? I could be offended by that, or I could listen and understand, you know what, that's some pretty good ideas. I've changed the way I do them. I've changed the way the contact comes to you. I've also changed just some of the production value of it to upgrade it a little bit. Yet the general principle is still here the same. Pretty raw, it's just me. My hair is usually out of control. Never know what I'm going to be wearing that day or what the weather is going to be like. We just do this. However, if I had to rationalize they're good enough in the beginning, we never would have grown. So in your life, whether it's in your relationship, whether it's in your job or just getting a job, quit rationalizing to yourself, which really means you're rationally lying to yourself. Let's start looking at how we can improve upon things just by listening to the feedback other people give us. Right now is a great time to learn, a great time to grow. Never look at any of this as criticism or something wrong with you. People rationalize when they're afraid. People also criticize you and also call attention to what you're doing and say you can improve upon this because they're interested in you. They're interested in what you are doing. Take that as a compliment if they even care enough to tell you you could improve and show you how. So until next time, this is Dr. Gary wishing you a very rational day without lying to yourself. You think about that. Have fun with it. Bye-bye.